Hey, what's going on guys? It's the Lego Mandalorian here, and today we will be reviewing the new Brickheads pack, which is Luke Skywalker and Yoda. So this set has uh, 215 pieces, retails for 15 bucks in the United States. So anyway, let's get on to the review. Alright, so here we got Luke Skywalker. So now, as you can see, one thing I really like about him is he's got his blaster and he's got his lightsaber, which I think that was a really cool addition to just his overall design. So first off, you can see he's got um, these exclusive torso pieces. Well, technically they're brick pieces. Um, now actually, if you look like, just like his front hair, like is very very well designed and like just if you look around like all of it there's a lot of really good details um so yeah I just wanted to say I really like his hair um yeah just like I said they did a lot they put a lot of effort into making it look um like you know very like shaggy I yeah that's probably the right word to use so then like as you can see like on the side like it's not very smooth which was like kind of what the designers were going for um so yeah, on this side, there's nothing really there, um, on his back, so it kind of, like, they kind of made, like, his hair, like, look long, like, by doing, like, these two pieces, and then, like, having it, like, on the ends be, like, kind of shaggy, um, which, like, that is pretty accurate to what look, Luke looked like in The Empire Strikes Back, uh, and as you can see on the other side, uh, kind of the same thing, but this time his, uh, he's holding a blaster pistol, um, so, yeah, that's pretty cool. Um, yeah, like his belt holding his lightsaber. Um, I think it actually did come with the the lightsaber blade, but um, since like I just have his lightsaber be on his uh on his belt, I don't really use the blade. Um, so yeah, that's that's what I think about the Luke Skywalker. <clears throat> um, so let's move on to Yoda. So I'm not going to cut this. Here is Yoda right now. So. Yoda's obviously a lot smaller than Luke, which it makes perfect sense. Um, actually, he is uh, he's about the same size as Hedwig from the Harry Potter line. So I think that was pretty cool. Um, I mean, even though Yoda's definitely a lot bigger than Hedwig. Uh, so anyway, um, so on his front, um, there's just, you know, some exclusive brick printing for his, uh, for his robe. He's got his walking stick, um, now his ears, like, yeah, they do go out, like, on the sides, like he does in the movies, which, which, yeah, that's accurate to, uh, what he looks like, obviously, so then one thing that I do really like about his design, how he's got, like, his gray hair, like, behind his ears, um, so yeah, nothing much else about that, so then you got, like, what hair he's got left on the back of his head, then on the side, we got, uh, him again, same thing, um, so yeah, nothing, nothing special about him, I mean, his design's fairly simple, so you don't really need to go overboard with the details, so, anyway, uh, that's what I think about this, uh, Brickhead, I'd probably give it, like, a 9 out of 10, maybe even 9.5 out of 10, I do think this was a really great Brickhead, as you guys know, um, ah, you know, Luke Skywalker and Yoda are some of my favorite Star Wars characters of all time. So anyway, guys, if you like this video, you can give it a like. If you want to see more of this kind of content, you can subscribe and leave your thoughts about the Luke Skywalker and Yoda brickheads in the comments section below. And as always, I'll see you guys next time.